What's up guys, I'm going to do another Advanced Warfare video, and this time I'm going to go into Master Prestige number 10. And yeah, so I've had a pretty good amount of luck with supply drops throughout this Prestige. I was lucky enough to get myself a second one of these just a couple minutes ago. I got the Hole Puncher, which I was pretty excited about, but I still have not used yet. Um, <clears throat> what else? I still am a little bit sick. Uh, not as bad as the last time. Um, where is it? I sold one of my chicaneries, but then I decided I'll probably keep all my elite guns. Like, I was trying to rank up fast, so I was like, oh, I have a bunch of duplicate um, elite weapons, so I just started deleting a bunch of them. But then I was like, yeah, maybe I, I'll probably just keep my full armory of elite weapons. So I did delete a couple of those. Um, I was lucky enough to get the AK-12 royalty, but it's not the RIP. Instead, it is the f uh, feeder, maybe? No? Something like that. Uh, it's the other elite version. I also got the Gigawatt again. Um, so I got that one from my from uh, prestiging and I think I'm gonna get the bare fist this time I think that's what it is I got a couple more blender buses oh I got the SVO dude I love this gun so much I was so happy when I got it like it is such an awesome sniper and I love using it I also got the samurai loadout out of a advanced supply drop for hitting level 30 I think it was but yeah so uh, these past like five levels I was trying to get three regular supply drops to open along with my advanced supply drop but I only got two and one of these was my daily supply drop challenge and it took me probably like two and a half hours to grind out these last five levels and I only got one supply drop like I got the other supply drop through my challenge so I don't know why it wasn't giving me any um, classes Here's my SVO class. Freaking love this thing. I got a couple of the challenges done for it. Have all the all but one detachment now. Uh, I've been using the EPM3, and I honestly like this gun. It's not super bad. Um, it's a pretty decent gun. Uh, use this a tiny bit. Uh, I now have this one diamond, so I'm pretty close to getting royalty. It's the Sac 3 and the. AMR9, that's the only two I have left until I get royalty. I uh, was trying to get the last couple of challenges for this. Um, that I don't know how I'm going to get this one unless I find someone who's like AFK or something. These shouldn't be too hard. Um, and then I use this gun a little bit just for the straight up player kills. M16 used it a little bit. I basically have been doing the no perks and no attachments challenges a lot this prestige and you'll see that a lot with the uh, heavy weapons so I uh, use the blunderbuss a tiny bit uh, use this for like half a game uh, was doing the no perks challenge which I am a fourth of the way done with I now have the ohm diamond because all I had left to do was no perks and no attachments and some long shots uh, Pytech, I got, oh, I guess I didn't get it done today, but I got the, both of these challenges done today, so I have hip fire challenges. Uh, use this a little bit. I still need to do a bunch of challenges and stuff for this. I have this royalty now too, or I guess diamond, and then I got this one done today as well. Um, this one is the no attachments. And yeah, so that's pretty much all my classes. Combat record, 55,000 kills. Um, my win loss has been really coming down a lot lately. And my KD has dropped a bit too. But honestly, I don't really care about my stats anymore. I just want to hit mass Grandmaster Prestige and just get as many challenges out of the way as possible. Because I usually would just use the Battle 27 or the ASM 1. And if I only use those two guns, I guarantee my KD and my win-loss would go up. But I've been using things like the EPM-3, the SAC-3, the Pytech, you know, just a bunch of unorthodox guns that people wouldn't normally use. And uh, they're honestly not that bad, 
but when you're going up against teams full of speakeasies and ASM1s and uh, Battle 27s and stuff, then it gets kind of hard, and it's hard to get a high KD, or at least like a 2 KD when you're using like the SVO on a close quarters map. I love the STG so much. I really hope we get this out of one of these three supply drops we have. Uh, I really love that gun. I would even be fine with a like any other gun. So like if I got the Cell 3, I think this gun's pretty good too. AK, I wouldn't even mind that. I just want a new gun. Um, I'm currently recording this video on a Monday, and that means tomorrow uh, there's going to be two new more weapons coming to Advanced Warfare. So that'll be the M1911 and the MP40. I assume the MP40 is just going to be a reskin of the KF5, and the M1911 is just going to be a reskin of the Atlas 45 pistol. Uh, they're probably going to have the exact same sounds and about the same stats, something like that. Uh, metals. Nothing has really changed here throughout any of my prestiges. Over 9,000 hard points secured. Played rank play a little bit. This was for a couple of my daily supply drop challenges. Uh, leaderboards, 20,000 on the Xbox One. I'm probably in the top 5,000 for the 360. Uh, TDM, played this a tiny bit. Haven't played free for all in a while. Um, there was a clan war this last weekend, so I just basically went through a bunch of random game modes and played those and captured all the nodes. Hard point, I'm now 71,000 on here. I'm interested to see what I am on the Xbox 360 because the only uh, leaderboards that uh, transfer through are your career. But so uh, my hard point challenge or my hard point stats don't transfer, which is kind of a shame um, because last time I checked on the 360, I was still in the top thousand, but I guarantee I'm probably <clears throat> 10,000 now, something like that. So. Yeah, let's prestige. Um, I think I will do the bulldog for this one. There we go, and we have like five prestiges left to go. Thunder Tusk, I already have that gun. Nice. Well, I guess if I really needed to, I could sell it. Uh, care package, all. Um, let me sell something real fast, and then we'll open up the other one, and then yeah. Where is the? <coughs> Where is it? Dealer? Oh, right here. Okay. Eh, I think I have every single one of those. And then what are we going to get in this? Okay, nothing great out of this. So, yeah, I can sell pretty much all of these, but there you guys go. There is all of my stats and everything um, I've been cruising through the last couple of prestiges a little bit and yeah like I've been cruising through uh, I have maybe 22 days to hit Grandmaster Prestige before uh, if I want to get those supply drops and get that bonus thing um, yeah so I'm now prestige 10, still have a few more to go, but yeah, um, I've been rocking the Black Ops 3 player card, just because I think it looks the best out of any of them, really. Um, yeah, well, I could rock that, that's pretty cool. Yeah, so there you guys go. Thanks for watching, tell me what rank and prestige you guys are in the comments down below, and a lot of people have been uh, just skipping out on advanced warfare lately like after the black ops 3 beta they've just stopped playing and 
Uh, some people went and played Taken King for Destiny and Rainbow Six Siege and Assassin's Creed Syndicate's coming out soon too. So uh, tell me if you're still playing this game and what prestige and stuff you guys are in in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video.